Katrina and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am super excited to shoot today's video because I finally get to show you guys my entire closet and this closet is completely different from my Indian closet. So if you have not watched my Indian closet tour, I'm going to link it right here so you can watch it later. So I live in downtown Toronto and the apartments here are super small and my closet is also very tiny. So over here, my wardrobe changes twice a year, once in the winter and once in the summer. So when I moved here, it was very cold. So I moved into this apartment in January. And when I moved, I only got all my winter clothes because I did not need any of my summer clothes yet. So all my summer clothes and shoes and everything was still at my in-laws house. So this weekend, we finally went back because of COVID. We couldn't go for the longest time. So I got all my stuff back and that's what you see right here. And I'm so happy. I'm so happy that I got everything back. So now the task is to fit all of this into the tiny space that I have. And I wanted to take you guys through my entire closet, show you guys how I organize things when it comes to my clothes, shoes, jewelry, makeup, and all of that. So I hope you guys enjoy watching this video. And right now I'm gonna start unpacking everything and then let's see how things go. this cabinet in my living room which was empty so I'm just gonna put all my shoes in here unpacked everything and I've put everything in separate piles so it's easier for me to put everything back in the closet. The next task is basically to empty out everything I have in my closet right now. So I want to make sure that I start off with a clean slate so I can organize everything based on what I need in the next two months. So basically now I'm going to start emptying out my entire closet. I think I saw your face in the moon. I promise I'll be with you as soon as I find a emptied out my closet and I am freaking out because I'm looking at all the stuff right now and there's way too much stuff. I need to figure out how to put this all in a place where it all fits right in. But I have this unit where it has four different shelves. I have emptied out the bottom one and I've put some of that stuff in the top three. And I also have this chest of drawers. So this used to be a part of my dressing table which I used to use when I was living at my in-laws house. And I did not want to put a dresser here in my room because I didn't want too much for furniture outside. So the first drawer is Jahan's and that's where he puts all of his personal items. The second drawer is mine. This is where I put all of my makeup and I don't like hoarding on makeup especially because it expires and it goes bad and I don't want to mess with my skin because of that. So in the third drawer I keep my lingerie. I'm not going to open that because I don't want to show that to you guys. And the last drawer is where I keep my accessories. So I have a lot of my nail polishes and all my nail art tools here and a few of my necklaces and bracelets here. But majority of my accessories are behind this door. I got this from Amazon and I love how it organizes all my jewelry. So this is how I like to keep it. I put some of Jahan's clothes in the outside closet. So we have another closet outside for the coats and shoes. So I have put all his pants there and all his blazers. And over here, I have his suits, I have some of his shirts and his cardigans. And I do have another pile of his sweaters, but I feel like I'm just gonna put this on the shelf above clothes racks here. And now I'm gonna start putting all of my stuff in. So first, I'm gonna start off by hanging some stuff on this side. So this section is done. I'm not gonna add too much here because I don't wanna make it too bulky. But now I'm gonna start filling up these sections so this middle thing right here is uh, like a hanger that I got from Ikea. It was only 10 to $15. And the best thing is that you can hang it anywhere you want. So it has Velcro on top and you can just put it on any clothes rack. I just love the fact that it has so many shelves. It just helps me keep all my clothes organized. So on the top shelf, I'm going to put a few tops. And I just want to put all the tops which are very lightweight. Because as you guys can see, the more weight I put is going to curve in. So I just want to put very light things here. 
So in the second shelf, I'm gonna put my bottom wear. So all the shorts, which are again, very lightweight. So all the cotton ones and all the polyester ones and a few denim ones, so nothing too bulky. So in the third shelf, I'm gonna add all my kurtis and all my leggings. So in the top shelf right here, I'm gonna add all my dresses. In the second shelf over here, I'm gonna add uh, all my tops. I have made two different piles, so I'm gonna put that here. So moving on to the bottom part of the closet. So in this shelf right here, I'm gonna put all my workout wear. And now in this shelf, I'm gonna put all my bottom wear, so all my denims and all my pants. So in this corner down here, I'm going to put all my bags. So that's it. I just have 7 to 8 bags, which is more than enough for me. All my bags are still in India. I could not bring everything here. So yeah, this is good enough. So now, into these two sections, I'm going to add all my basic t-shirts, spaghetti tops, tube tops, and all the basic innerwear. I do have some space down here so what I'm gonna do is I got these baskets from Ikea and I'm putting all of Jahan's daily wear clothes so all his gym clothes and all his home clothes in here so I'm just gonna put this basket right under this I'm done with this side of the closet and now I'm gonna do the top shelves so I have a bunch of these uh, baskets the Ikea ones that I just showed you I have a bunch of these so I'm basically gonna try to organize all of my stuff into that and then whatever's left over we'll see what to do and then after that I'm gonna start hanging all of my dresses and palazzo pants. So when it comes to hanging my clothes I did not want to use 50 hangers I just wanted to minimize the number of hangers I use so what I've done is I've put three dresses on each hanger just like this. I am loving my closet. I love how this looks and I'm so glad that I can even see all my clothes again now that I have all of them back. And I'm super excited to wear each and every piece of clothing here for the next three months that I have this good weather for. So here is the final reveal of my closet. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and stay tuned for more videos just like this. I'll be back very soon. Until next time, take care of yourself, stay safe, and you'll see me soon. Bye! Stays and nights